Hey guys, it's Kathy Crafty Chica. I have a super fun project for you guys today. This is an old school project I've been making for years. It's these really fun little bottle cap shrine magnets. Who doesn't have bottle caps laying around the house? Number one, you're gonna need bottle caps. And after that, go through your craft supplies and look for all of the tiny little micro doodads that you have, letter beads, um, word beads, any little um, sequins or crystals or gems, charms, all of that will come in handy. I even like to use magnetic poetry. All right, now we're talking glue guns. So preferably use two different types of glue guns. You can use one, but I found it's easier to have one big one with a clear glue stick and then one little one for the glitter glue sticks. All right, for your first bottle cap magnet, we're going to put a layer of the clear hot glue at the bottom and fill it up about halfway. Do not let it cool or harden. Now we're gonna add a layer of the glittered hot glue all around it so that you can see only glitter glue. The reason I do this is because you don't want to use up all your glitter glue because you're gonna, not going to see the clear glue on the bottom. Okay, now let's insert our first piece. You have to work kind of fast because you don't want the glue to cool or harden. So gather up your little items that you plan to put in your bottle cap and set them there so that you can easily grab them. Because I guarantee you're going to want to move them around a little bit and arrange them the way that you want. Quickly insert your other items. And I like to use the tiny little beads and the sequins, the metallic stars, as a way to fill in the open areas. Use a crayon to pick up the little metallic stars and place them where you want them. This also works for crystals too. When your glitter glue stick gets low, simply insert a different color of the glitter glue stick. Once they're all cooled and hardened, then you can hot glue a sturdy magnet on the back. So this is the first collection of these that I made for this crafty roundabout. I'm so excited to make like a hundred more of these. It's so addicting and therapeutic. Look, this one is a little barrette. And that's it. Thank you so much for checking out my project. Visit craftychica.com for even more crafty ideas. Like, share, and subscribe, and go get crafty. Thanks, guys. Bye-bye.